Hi, Jared from Ontario Wildlife Removal, and we're here to show you what happens with window wells. We get this a lot with skunks. They fall down in the window wells but can't get back up. So we came here, we tried to get this little guy out. Um, you'll see in the previous video how they were getting under the window well once they got into the window well. So we had to set a trap. Well, today we're back and we've got the skunk in the trap, so we're going to try and see if we can get him out without spraying it. We seem to be receiving these calls a lot more and um, we're going to teach you what you can do to help prevent them from doing this. So what we do is um, this skunk, he went down into the window well and then as, as the days progressed and it got hot in here, he learned that he could get underneath this window well. There's a gap, probably about two to three inches, that he could get under and go into the corners. So. When we arrived, we knew that we just couldn't go in and snare, pull him out and rescue him. So we set a trap and at this point, we've now got him out. But what we want you to learn here is, although they do have, um, I'll show you this grate that goes over, okay? It's more for um, humans to not get down there and break into the place. Uh, it's not really strictly for wildlife. So if there's a way you have a window well on your property and you can screen it off or seal it off so the wildlife can't fall down and not be able to get out. Um, if they weren't vigilant enough to you know, keep looking at these areas every day for security and for cleanliness, then this skunk might have died in this uh, window well. Um, so a happy ending here, um, but just want to make sure that uh, um, if you have a window well, make sure that you're securing it off and that way you don't have to give us a call here at Ontario Wildlife. Thank you and have a great day.